Okay, so we're here at 3353 Madeira Avenue in Los Angeles. We started off by running our camera from a four inch two way cleaner that's located here on the right hand side of the house. This is for the main house. And apparently the guest house is, is all connected right over here, right Al? Yeah, the guest house connected to it. Okay, so right now we got our camera in and we're all the way out to the city connection in the street. There's the city sewer right there, you can see it flowing by. Here's your connection to the city. We have a six inch clay lateral yes. coming in. It comes to back to some concrete pipe. There's a little bit of roots over there. A little bit of roots coming through the coupling over here. It actually kind of dives down over there. So as we come back, this is a concrete pipe. There goes some roots that probably knocked out with our camera went down the line. A little bit of roots coming in at the couplings over here. So this pipe's definitely going to need some hydro jetting. There's no doubt about that. Did you, Alex, just go forward there a little bit there. Okay, well, it's difficult to say if they're coming through the joint or whatever. The line's going to need to be cleaned. Comes back to some clay piping over here. Now remember, we're looking for big breaks in the line or massive dislocations or things like that. So far the line looks in fair condition but does have some roots. A little shift there. A little shift yeah. over there, huh? And this is the four by six. That's the four by six here? Yeah, right here. You can see there's a lot of like paper towels and stuff over there. This line is definitely gonna need to be hydrogeted and then re inspected. So we're going to keep coming back. Just ABS. ABS plastic over here, okay. Now I'm offering you my opinion. Um, this is based on what I see over here. I don't, you know, I look for big problems in a sewer line. Uh, I don't look for little problems. As you're going to find this in older pipes, it's very common. What we are going to definitely recommend is a hydro jetter here so that line can be cleaned properly so we can examine it a little bit better. It's all ABS plastic of here. It's all in good condition. Can we go upstream quickly? Don't okay, clean up the lens there. He's going to put the camera in upstream. It's a short run. Oh, it's a very short run. That, that two-way clean out even. It's pointless. You see, it goes straight into yeah. the toilet. Okay, so listen, um, we cannot check very much underneath the house over here. But everything's visible. You visible underneath? Yes. How does it look? Most of it's ABS plastic, short section of cast iron. Oil. Underneath there, huh? Yeah. What we're going to do is pause it. We're going to run it from the guest house. Okay, let me pause it. Okay, so the piece going through the foundation is very old cast iron pipe that should have been changed once they had replaced all the ABS plastic. Let me pause the recording over here. Okay, we're trying to go from the roof vent, but too many sharp turns. No, okay, don't, you don't want to break the camera. Okay, come back up. Okay, I'm going to pause the recording over here. Okay, so we're running the camera now from the clean-out located underneath the guest house. Pretty much everything's ABS plastic over here, the main line. Now remember, we cannot check every pipe in the house. We're checking the main sewer line over here. And this all ABS plastic coming from the guest house. It all looks like it's in good condition. Of course, we're going to have the general inspector going to do a more thorough inspection once it falls underneath the, the two houses over here. That's probably right there where the main house ties in. All ABS plastic, all looks good. Remember never to suck tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. So we've got running the camera from the key out that's underneath the house, the guest house. ABS 
Yeah. Okay, here it comes out of the clean out underneath the house. We're going to go ahead, stop the recording over here. I think they want us to hydrojet the line, so we're going to call this video number one.